Literally never know when I'm gonna need one. Better safe than sorry. <laughs> you need scissors more than you think you do when you're in your car. Literally perfect. I'm going to organize what goes in here. Ugh, I love this one. I said, let me go to my car and grab you some. You need a brush in your car. Wet wipes, once again, mainly for nosebleeds. Restocking the car. I broke it. Welcome back to another video. This video is so highly requested and it's my number one when I go to like my analytics and I can see what like my audience is searching. This is my number one video. So welcome to what I keep in my car, my car essentials, restocking my car and cleaning my car. All in one, you're getting them all. So in this video, I'm gonna show you everything I keep in my car that's just like an essential for me. Like this stuff has to be in my car, how I keep it organized and we're gonna put everything back. I did just get my car back from getting fixed. I got a little accident, it was not my fault, but we got my car back and I had to take everything out for it to get serviced. So now there's like nothing in it, everything's in this bag. So I'm gonna show you what all I keep in here, what I rate it, how long it's been in here, and then we're gonna have to put everything back to where it needs to be. So this is the bag. I currently have everything that goes in my car in. The tripod is not included, it's just in here for filming purposes. But let's get into it, shall we? Oh wait, I should probably show you this first. One second. Yes, I have a broom in my car right now. Okay. So I am 17 and a half. I don't wanna talk about it. And I have tried so many different organizational tactics the whole time I've had my car. And this is my best I've found. I used to have one of those like square cubby boxes to keep everything in, but I finally got like an actual car organizer from Amazon. It is like slanted so you can see things a lot easier. And this is what I keep majority of my stuff in. A couple things that are already in here are a purse hook. So this just goes on your little metal part right here and you can hold your bags right there. This is a quick fix first aid kit on the go. Band-aids, all that kind of stuff. And then also I keep some ponchos in here. My car is definitely overstocked maybe, but to me, these are all the things I need. So first off, clothes. I keep so many changes of clothes in here. Just like basic things. You never know what's gonna happen. So you might spill something. You never know. So this is a workout top. This is some workout shorts. And then this is just a gray t-shirt. So always keep these in here. Deodorant. I cannot tell you how many times I've forgotten to put on deodorant and this has saved me. You can even do a mini deodorant you just need to keep in your car. Waters, little mini waters, mainly for like guests in the car, not per se for myself, but waters they're never gonna let you down i will say don't keep them in hot temperatures because then like the plastic dissolves and everything but other than that love this is one of my extra items um a food bowl for animals i just can't see a stray cat and not feed it so there's this and then there's also some cat food down in here that i keep in my car this is a little mini it's supposed to be like for rush but i found it to be very practical it has like tampons it has cleaning wipes it has deodorant wipes it has makeup remover polish remover some like band-aids again nail glue did it just get brighter huh and it's just so compact that it comes in handy this is what i keep in my center console i took the like plastic divider part out and just keep everything in here these organizers were originally for my bathroom and for my toiletries when we had traveled but it fits perfectly and i use it for this and i also use the other one for my snacks but in here i keep a tied to go pin because no one is messier than me and no one gets more nosebleeds than me i just need it all the time a little baby lint roller some Brazilian bum bum cream, extra chargers for two different types of phone. I have the iPhone 15, which is a new charging port. So it's that one and then also the old. More deodorant, I have to have this in my car. Like it just has to. Roller perfume, spray perfume, a little mini tester. And the roller perfume was the Glossier U. It's just the perfect little compact size. Two different forms of lip balm, one balm.com and one aquaphor. All of my friends are aquaphor girlies, so gotta keep it for them. Dry shampoo. I had a reason I started putting this in here and I honestly can't remember it now. 
there was a reason and a pin. This and deodorant are my number one takeaways for keeping in your car. They're basic items that you always forget about, but they come in so handy when you have them. So that's what's in this side. And on the other side, I just keep a few things. One of them is this giant ring of hair ties. There's so many on here. This was when I did competitive cheer. It was the number one thing people asked for. I said, let me go to my car and grab you some. <gasps> no, I should have grabbed some gum for restock out of gum oopsies and then these are my little air freshener disc for my record player air freshener and more chargers so that's what goes in here and like i said it goes in my middle console my next thing everyone makes fun of me for it but it's once again so convenient for so many different reasons so it goes on your steering wheel <laughs> and it becomes like a tray. It's for fast food, but it can also be for working. You can write, like this is so functional. It doesn't come off and it comes in so many different colors. This is a 10 out of 10 recommendation, 100%. I don't regret it at all. An umbrella, of course, along with the ponchos, I have to have an umbrella. And this is one I don't use too much, so I know it could be just thrown in the car. Another clothes item, I'm always cold so i keep a sweatshirt in here it can be one that you don't really wear i really only wear this when i go to disney so i knew it would be a good car one an extra tripod i just literally never know when i'm gonna need one so i keep it in here and it has like a phone and a camera stand so that's nice a costco size dots this doesn't go with the rest of the snacks this goes in the back pouch of my car seat because i need to be able to reach it no matter what these are my number one car snack and i get the costco size and i'm pretty sure this is like my third bag just for the car. I love you dots. A license and registration holder. Of course, mine is pink. I've had this one since I was 16. It was the first one I got and I really love it. It's nice quality. It's very durable. It has multiple different parts. So it has all the ones I'm covering plus the one that my car wash membership is in. It's very convenient and compact. Her Perfume. I keep two perfumes. One just ran out. I usually have one on each front door just because it's so nice to be able to throw on whenever you need. Passengers use it a lot. Sophia, my mom, everyone uses this. You can see how almost empty it is. It's just really convenient to have. Same thing with a brush. I keep it in my door. You need a brush in your car before work, before anything. You need to be able to have it. My little record player air freshener. It's so cute. I love it. Hand sanitizer. Of course, I keep the Capri Blue. Pretty much every time I get in my car, I put on hand sanitizer. So safety wise, I keep pepper spray because I'm just a girl in the world. I need pepper spray. And this little guy, I've never had to use him. And if I'm being completely honest, I don't really know how to use him. But it's an eight in one screwdriver plus a flashlight. So if I really needed to use it as like a weapon, I bet I could but better safe than sorry. <laughs> I also have two trash cans. They're different ones. I wanted to try them both out. This one has like a flap and it's silicone. This one is plastic and it has a push. I personally like this one more. The quality is just better and the lid doesn't get lost. Like if this lid comes off, you have to find it and then it looks weird. So I like this one better, but I keep one on my side and one on the passenger side. I did need to restock a few things, so I just swung by Target. I did film a little bit, so here is me going to Target for some restock items. Okay, we're at Target and we need to pick up a few things to restock the car. We need the wipes and snacks because my sisters ate all my car snacks. So we're gonna refill. Okay, these are my go-to wipes because they're so compact. I have leather seats, so I'm gonna grab the leather. The cleaning, just for basic cleaning. And usually they have glass, but they seem to be out. But I think I have a few left of those. These are cute. Look how cute these are. How do I smell? Oh, that's nice. They're like air sealed. Oh, someone opened this one. I honestly like them both. I think I'm gonna try these out. Fun times. As far as snacks goes, I used to keep them in my car mainly for cheer in between practices. We'd go out to my car and be like, what do you want from the concession stand? But now it's more catered towards my sisters. So I'm gonna get some fruit snacks. I also always love to keep peanut butter crackers and some kind of bar. I've been doing Nutri-Grain bars just because they don't melt, but I feel like I wanna do something different because those don't really ever make me feel like good, you know? So I'm trying to think of my options. I think I'm gonna do, wait, granola. Oh, this is soft bake. This is regular. I think I'm gonna do this. Okay, 
Okay, we got quite a few things. I'm gonna be honest, this is so cute, but the smell isn't my favorite. So I got the two air fresheners and the only way for me to be able to smell them is by opening. Oh, there's two. Oh, there's three. I like this one. Which one am I gonna put in first? Honestly, I could do them both. They're really cute. Colors together. That one's not as good as I thought it was. We're probably just gonna do the pink one. So we'll put that in once we start restocking the car. And then I did have a few wipes left, but I could never get enough. The cleaning, the leather, and then this is the protectant ones. I got them once and I've never gone through the whole stack. They just make everything kind of like oily. So I don't really ever use them. And then the snacks, of course. That was all the stuff I took out for my car appointment. This is all the stuff I didn't take out. First in my glove box, wet wipes, once again, mainly for nosebleeds. You might wonder why I have to throw up bags from the hospital. My mom had a 14 day long migraine and could not make it to the hospital without throwing up. And then we realized how convenient it was. So I grabbed two from the hospital and they've been in here ever since. Scissors. You need scissors more than you think you do when you're in your car. So I put them in here. Extra utensils. I cannot tell you how many times I've gotten fast food or I've had my own food, but I need a utensil. And I don't have one. Any chance I get from Chipotle Cava, I grab some. Of course, napkins and this little sauce motto. It goes in like an air freshener on your vents and it holds your sauces. So, mom got it for me and it's pretty convenient. And an air tag. I am just really paranoid that someone's gonna steal my car. But that's everything that is in my glove box. There's nothing in my console right now because it's all cleared out. I always keep a lip balm in just this little compartment that it's easy for me to grab. I think that's all, possibly. I also forgot to tell you that I'm in one of my favorite parking garages and it's across from like a business building so that I can like see the business memo working so sometimes i feel judged by them most of the time not we'll see how it goes today but other things i have hanging from my mirror i have a disco ball i have this like tree scented air freshener and a disco ball one this one ran out a long time ago it's mainly just for decoration i'll probably take them both out today to put the new one but keep this one to put back as decoration like i said and then these little light catchers are so fun they're on my sunroof and you can barely notice them unless the sun is like shining and then they put like rainbows into the car it's just a really cool touch that i like to have also of course i have a phone holder but I think I'm gonna switch over to this one today if I can get it figured out. Okay, that is officially all of the things I keep in my car. So now let's start restocking. Also, if you're watching and you don't know what kind of car I drive, let me introduce you. I have a beautiful 2019 Ford EcoSport titanium version and she is perfect. I wanted not a car low to the ground, but not like a huge car. And she's just like literally perfect. And fun fact, the day my mom bought this car for me, she wasn't even planning on buying a car. So that's how I ended up with this car. First order of business is taking everything out. So I'm gonna put everything back in the bag and put it in here so I can disperse it from there and put everything where it's supposed to go. I also have my work bag in here. Oh, there's a trash can right ne next to me. This is gonna be so convenient. Okay, my work bag out, a broom and an umbrella. I'm gonna put my hot works mat in the front so it doesn't get like dirty on the ground. Okay. I think this is pretty much everything. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this in my center console since it's the only thing that goes in there and start organizing this. First up, I'm going to organize what goes in here. So I'm gonna fold all this back. This goes in the front, obviously, and just kind of go through and organize things by section of the car it goes in. This needs to be refilled with snacks. This is a tripod I normally use. It goes on like the screen in my car and I put it under the seat so that it's out of the way, but easy accessible. This goes in with the other clothes and the umbrella. Okay, as far as restocking my snack pouch, like I said, I use this one that I used to use for my toiletries. Obviously I cleaned it out pretty good. It's the same one I use in my center console. So let's put the bars. I'm excited to try these and also get the sisters' opinions on them. When I go see them, their first thing is always, Sissy, do you have snacks in your car? Can we go get some snacks from your car? So I try to keep ones they like in there and they like bars like that. They love these. I'll put these in here too. I'm actually gonna go ahead and put one of the fruit snacks and one 
of the peanut butter crackers in the one in my console in case I need them quick while I'm driving. This is gonna go in the trunk so I wouldn't be able to reach it. I also keep liquid IVs in here. This was more for when I was running outside but obviously it's winter now and I can't do that. Hello? Like how many can I fit in here? <laughs> It doesn't need to zip all the way. And we're gonna end up putting two in the one in the console. Okay, the waters also go in here with the snacks and as well as the wipes. I'm gonna put them in here. This goes in my door, so we'll put that up there. As well as this and this. The used wipes, so I can make sure I use these before the new ones, I'm gonna put in the side pockets that are mesh. My eight and one screwdriver. I'm gonna put this other air freshener in the side pocket as well. The one on the other side. I'm gonna take the one of these out that I'm gonna put on the car and the other ones in the pouch. Trash can in the door. I think that's it. The tripod goes in here as well. Okay, so this is gonna go in the trunk. that right there as well as the fast food truck. I just love that this one doesn't take up room compared to the box one that I had forever and I feel like you can just see everything so much more. Ugh, I love this one. Okay the Dodds pretzels are gonna flatten out and go in this pocket. See they fit perfect and then this is a new addition I forgot about. Mom got it for me. It can cut your seatbelt and break your window in case of emergency. She's gonna go in this door cup holder right now. Putting back all the stuff that I need to take inside. The broom is funny to me. Okay, we're back in the car. I need to put those snacks. Look how literally perfect it fits. Isn't that funny? Okay, the snacks need to go in here. One fruit snack, two things of crackers. Perfect. The air freshener is gonna go up just for looks, but I am also going to break out this air freshener and take down my other two. This one actually smells really good. It's bouquet flavored or scented. Sorry, <laughs> whichever one you like to say. I honestly don't know if I'm gonna be able to get these down. They've been up here for so long. Um, hello? Oh, those are twisted. Scissors. Like I said, you need scissors more than you think. I'm gonna have to cut this one for sure. I mean, it's so entertained in there. Oh wait, no, there we go. There's that string. I'll be back when I figure this out. Okay, literally 20 minutes later, got it. So that one I'm gonna save. This thing's gonna go up. She's cute, I like her, I like her a lot, very cute. And then the brush, the perfume, and the hand sanitizer go in my side door. And I am gonna try to set up this new tripod thingy, but I really don't know how to. Okay, so this goes onto your surface. Perfect. And then your phone goes to this one, but I don't know if it will because of my thingy. Okay, it does. It does. Oh yeah, you can see it, nice. Okay, and the nice thing is also, I can do it like that and do 0.5. So anytime I'm filming when I'm driving, I'm not ever touching anything. And I'm also eyes on the road, not at the camera. Okay, I think I like that a lot because this one kind of just gets in my way. It's just huge. I don't even know if I can get it off. I'm using all of my power right now. I need like a card. Here, I'll use this. <laughs> I don't want to use scissors because that's going to mess up my window. It's literally been on here for so long. I broke it. I'm sure mom can fix it. In the bag to take in it goes. Oh my gosh. Okay, I got all of it off to see if mom can fix but like the sticky thing, like clear stuff is still on it. And I think I'm going to have to get like Windex or something. But this is my car! Well, thank you.
thank you guys so much for watching i hope you got some ideas for your car especially if you're about to turn 16 or getting your first car or anything like that getting a new car congratulations first of all and i hope you found some products that are going to help keep you organized and have a fun car because i have a fun car my car's a fun car for sure thank you so much for watching this is a video i've never done on youtube i've only done like a tiktok when i first got my car and i'm excited to see what you guys think well I love you so much. Everything will be linked in the description. Okay, love you. Bye.